If you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Welcome to the Wisconsin Vegetable Gardener. I'm Joy Baird. Well, if you're like us, you've got some romaine lettuce maybe in the ground, but we've got some on our porch uh, in that grow bag and then some behind me over my shoulder that is going to seed or bolting because of the length of the day and the heat. Bolting is a sign that the plant is going into a reproductive state rather than a production, a seed production state rather than just growing for foliage. It will begin to grow vertically like this and if allowed to do such, it will get two and a half, three, four, five foot tall, put on a canopy of flowers that will turn into seed that you can save and grow in the fall or next spring. But when it gets to this stage, you can't eat it. It's very, very bitter. But there is a way in which you can eat it to get rid of the bitterness. So I've harvested some of this from back there. What we have is the central vein. You bite into it, it's bitter. That's where the bitterness lies in the plant right now. So what we can do is after we've harvested it, a little extra work here, but it will be beneficial. Take a pizza cutter, run on each side of that vein, cut out that center, that's compost, and then this is as tender and as crisp as lettuce you will ever buy. And you can just do this, work this through all of them. Cut that central vein out, compost material there. And you can take these and tear these up a little more for your sow. But that is how you can get rid of the bitterness from your romaine lettuce and continue to eat the romaine lettuce even through the hottest portions of the summer. Now the key to this is keeping your plants hydrated and making sure they're not stressed. Any discoloration of leaves such as at the bottom here, you want to avoid set things like that. But the main body of the plant is going to be edible as long as you take that central stem out and you'll have great lettuce. This is the green kind. We find that the burgundy kind doesn't go to seed as quickly as the, as the, red, as the green kind does here. So thanks for watching. Join me again for more gardening tips and techniques. I'm Joy Baird and this has been the Wisconsin Vegetable Gardener. For more information, please visit the WisconsinVegetableGardener.com.